Hello, everybody. How is everybody doing today? Thank you so much for coming to the webinar. Um, I want to welcome you and um, tell you a little bit about what we're going to be going over today. Uh, this is the MyLion mobile app, and it is a new quick report prototype. It's not something that we have planned to release anytime soon, but we wanted to share with you early on so that we can get some good feedback. Um, this webinar is intended for persons who are familiar with the MyLion app. Uh, we won't be going over how to operate the mobile app. We simply will be showing a demo of potential new feature called the Quick Report. You were selected to attend because you showed an interest in seeing a preview of the Quick Report concept that we are considering. My name is Liz Husky and I am with the product uh, team at Lions Clubs International. And I put together this presentation for you uh, with my team. Uh, the webinar was scheduled for one hour. However, the actual presentation is only going to take about 10 or 15 minutes. Um, based on the number of questions we receive, we may be able to end the webinar early within about 30 minutes or so. So you could get some of your time back today if, uh, if we have it. So just wanted to let you know. So we'll go ahead and get started. First and foremost, we value your input, so please feel free to write questions and feedback during this webinar using the questions section. You are a part of a focus group that will help us provide you with valuable tools that you can use while you serve others around the world. Your feedback will provide us with the necessary information we need to ensure that we deliver the best, most valuable tools to you. So in this webinar, we will share with you the quick report concept for the MyLion mobile app. We will show you a short video of the prototype for the feature. And we will review your feedback during the webinar. As again, based on the amount of time we've allotted, we'll try to review as many questions and feedback as we can with everyone at the end of the webinar. So why are we considering adding a quick report feature to the app? Well, first, we received feedback from people like you, our lions, saying that you desired this feature. And secondly, we want to reduce the need to enter service activity details in more than one place. So let's go ahead and look at the current state. With the My Lion mobile app, it allows anyone to create and share activities but you cannot report the impact that your service activity has made. A club officer needs to log into MyLCI to ensure that a completed service activity was properly recorded. Recording service activities is important so that the impact you make in the world is known and recognized as soon as possible. With the quick report feature, a club officer will be able to quickly report a completed service activity directly from the app. And this will benefit the clubs using the app because number one, details of the service activities do not need to be re-entered into MyLCI, and two, there will be faster reporting and recognition of the impact your service activity has made. Of course, MyLCI will remain available if the preference for the club officers is to go into MyLCI and enter the service activity details there. So now we will show you a quick video uh, regarding this new prototype. Hi everyone. I am Kirk Perry, the lead UX designer here at Lions Club International, and today I will be showing you the feature that we've been working on called Quick Report. The goal of this feature is to enable reporting officers to report service activities quickly from their mobile device. To get started, we arrive on the Create Report landing page, in which you will see your list of past and current service activities, and we'll be able to identify which activities you would like to report, which is marked with a report bug. Once you tap the past event that indicates that it needs to be reported, you can view that service activity and view details of the event, and then you can tap report again to report that event. There you are left with three questions in which you enter your data. How many people were served? How many volunteers participated? 
and your total volunteer hours. Once you enter the number and you hit report, you are done. You are given a notification that at any time, if you want to make an adjustment or further add details to your event, you can do so via My Lion Web. Now let's say you open your My Lion app and want to enter in a new service activity. With this new approach, you just go about creating a new activity by tapping the plus button on the top left corner and choosing a service activity. From there, you can enter in all of your fields and you can choose what date it is. If you choose a date that has previously passed, when you scroll down, you will notice that you cannot choose who can join as you are now in the quick report functionality. Once you tap proceed, you are notified that you are entering the quick report functionality. And upon selecting yes, you are faced with the same previous options for reporting an event. However, if you choose to select a date that is not already passed, then you will continue your process in creating a service activity. You will fill out your information and add a date that has not passed, and you can see that now you can choose who can see this as well as who can join. After tapping proceed, you are taken to the invite screen where you can invite people to your newly created event. Once you are done adding your invites, you are left with a confirmation saying your activity is ready to be finalized and sent to your invites list. Upon tapping proceed, you are done and your event has been created.